Good day. Today we're going to have a look at installing MU. Now I had a request for this a couple weeks ago of how to install MU version 1.02. So we're going to go ahead, we are going to run through both methods for doing that and uh, we'll just head over to the computer here and we'll start that up and then we'll go through the two methods of being able to install MU on your Raspberry Pi. So here we go over to the computer. On our desktop we are going to do uh, one thing uh, and that is go to the Raspberry uh, Pi icon in the top left here and then we're just going to go to preferences and then finally we're going to hit up the recommended software. So finally we have the recommended software come up. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and left click on the programming on the side here and right here, MU is the Python ID for beginners. So we're going to go ahead and make sure that's got an old check mark there. And uh, go ahead and click on OK. And then it will ask you for your uh, password most likely to install it on your Raspberry Pi. And that's it. Now to uninstall it, you just have to go back there. Go to your preferences, recommended software, and then uncheck it from here which we will do right now and then I'll go ahead and show you how to install it through the terminal as well. So here we go programs MU uncheck it and it says will be removed. So now it's going to go ahead and do that. All right, so now we've removed that, let's go ahead and press Control, Alt, and T on our keyboard. Uh, sudo apt get install mu dash editor. Hopefully I spelled that right, and there we go. Go ahead, hit Y, allow it to install. So this is the second method. I'll have the terminal commands in the description below so that way you can just copy it over or do it the, the first method through the recommended software. Then we can go ahead and close the terminal and then if we go to programming now we should see MU in there and then we can go ahead and get that launched. It is ready to go. And then I like it because it does have a dark theme. And there you go. Close out of that. Okay, so we installed MU on the Raspberry Pi with both methods. With uh, the recommended software through the Raspberry Pi icon as well as through the terminal. The uh, commands are in the description below just in case you might need them. Uh, just to quickly copy and paste them, whatever. So that is it for me for today. So make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, uh, check back here next week. We're going to have another video on the Raspberry Pi and uh, make sure to post any questions or comments below. Uh, if you have something you'd like me to uh, go over, by all means, let me know. But I will stress this. I am not an expert when it comes to the Raspberry Pi. I just show you what I learned along the way 
And if you guys have questions and I can answer them, I will certainly do so. So thanks for watching, everyone. You have a wonderful day, a wonderful week, and we'll see you next time. Take care, eh?